What is going on guys? Welcome back into a brand new video here on the channel. For today's video, I've got something different, something special that I've never done in my channel before. You know, I've shared with you my diets, I've shared with you full days of eating, when I've been bulking, cutting, or just maintaining, and 40 to 60% of those calories that I consume are carbs. But I've never shared with you a low carb diet. I've never done this before in my life, so I thought I'm gonna give it a shot today. I'm just gonna weight myself, show you my physique, and then after 24 hours, we're gonna see how much water weight we lose and if you're looking leaner. So that's gonna be it for today's video. If you are new on the channel, if you are not subscribed yet, my name is Gessi. I upload two times per week videos based around productivity, fitness, making money online, and basically vlogs documenting my life as a student and showing the journey. So if you are interested in this type of content, make sure to subscribe down below because it really helps me out. It really helps me reach my dream. So that's about it. Right now, I'm just gonna show you how my physique is looking and how much I weight. Let's go. All right, so we're currently weighing 74.5 kilos. I'm gonna give you a little physique update. All right, so I'm gonna take the same video after 24 hours at this exact same spot and we're gonna see the difference. Let's jump straight into the first meal of the day. All right, guys, so first meal of the day, two full eggs, 100 grams of egg whites, and then 85 grams of Don't run, don't turn left or turn right or look straight at the sun. My mind's gone in circles, I'm trying to fight it. Get in these voices inside to stay quiet. Go to the place. This is the first meal of the day. As you can see, we've got some eggs and ham, and we've got some protein shake right here, which is always amazing just to get some more protein in. This entire meal came out to 447 total calories, 69 grams of protein, 13 grams of carbs, and 12 grams of fat. Now, I usually like to eat French toast in the mornings just to get some more carbs in because that's what I enjoy, but I'm gonna jump straight into this meal. Mm. It's very nice actually. You can say an 8.5 out of 10. But French sauce is way way better. I've got this package today from Alphalete. Got myself a pair of new shorts. Two of them actually. So let's gonna see how they fit. My first time ordering from them. Some stickers as well. Okay, so first pair. Fit is pretty good actually. Very comfortable. So next one, I got same pair, but in a gray color. It's looking nice. I mean, it looked nicer on the website, but still looking pretty good. It's looking very nice. Both of these are size medium. And yeah. Guys, got two new recipes for lunch and dinner tonight. Low on carbs, so going currently at the groceries. Oh, <laughs> 
All right, guys, just came back from the supermarket. We're about to start with the second meal of the day. So pan is nice and hot. Can I put this in here too? Here we've got 175 grams of cauliflower. In the salt. And pepper. All right, so I'm gonna let this cook for five to 10 minutes. All right, so the chicken is also done right here. Five pieces of chicken, which equals nearly to 300 grams of raw chicken, and then the cauliflower rice. All right, guys, so here we've got lunch. We've got 300 grams of chicken breast and then 175 grams of cauliflower. As you can see right here, you can also add other vegetables like broccoli, carrots, but I'm not a big fan of those. So we only got cauliflower and some chicken. I'm gonna throw in some low calorie sauces. The chicken is done perfectly, it's always 10 out of 10. I've never had cauliflower rice before, but this is pretty, pretty good. After this meal, I'm going to the gym, so I'm gonna see myself how I perform with no carb in my system. Little time left starting right now. All right guys, so second meal is done. Really enjoyed this one, even though I'll probably give it an eight out of 10 overall. Later on, after an hour and a half, we're going to the gym, gonna have my workout, and then I'm gonna have the last meal of the day. So, we're just having three meals. All right, guys, I'm about to get some work done. It's super, super hot in Mallorca right now at the moment. Got this Red Bull right here, no sugar, so zero calories, zero carbs, of course. I have planned a lot of video ideas that I wanna share with you guys and I'm super super happy for those so so this morning before I ate breakfast I actually fasted and I did some deep work and I believe that deep work is actually super important to be done early in the morning because that's when you have the most energy so I finished doing some deep work I created a big list with a lot of video ideas and I want to shoot with you guys but right now for example what I enjoy doing after lunch I try to do some work which doesn't require a lot of ideas and thinking so basically at the moment right now I'm just going to edit the video get all the footage put it in my video editing software and start chopping and cutting some things that I don't want in this video at the moment I'm not going to do a lot of crazy edits in this video I'm just going to basically know if the video starts here ends here and those little parts in between so that's what I'm gonna do right now I'm gonna delete all the footage that is not necessary for the video and then Probably tomorrow morning I'll finish this video off. But yeah, let's go get some work done. Alright guys, just finished doing some work and if you're a long time subscriber, you know that I like to read a lot of books about personal development and I share them with you in my videos. So currently, two days ago, I started The Compound Effect. Now, this book is really really amazing and it has opened my eyes so if you are into personal development and you really want more from your life make sure to check out this book it will really open your eyes so i'm about to get ready go hit a good gym session and then we'll get back with the last meal of the day let's go get it in. On the other side of inhibition No apologies, my baby I tell you do cause I'm feeling so good Let me fool. 
So for the third meal and the final one of the day, we are doing a low carb pizza. Now I've got everything, all the ingredients right here. And for the base of this pizza, we're using eggplant. And then to get some more protein in to this meal, we're using some lean ground meat. So that's about it. I'm gonna start preparing and then share with you all the macros and how it tastes. So for our base of our pizza we are using eggplant so I'm gonna cook these ones for 10 minutes and then after 10 minutes I'm gonna throw everything on top and then cook them for another 10 minutes. Alright so I'll be throwing in 200 grams of lean ground meat. So that's 120. This should do it. Alright, so here we go. So I'm gonna cook this for five to ten minutes, but I don't wanna overcook it because as I'm gonna put it inside the oven, it's gonna cook there as well. So just for five minutes and then it will be done. The eggplants look like they're done. Remember, we're gonna cook them later again. So, this is gonna be like our base of our pizza. All right, so first we're gonna start with our sauce. I'm using in total 100 grams for all of these. So, let's start making these ones. All right, so that's gonna be about it. 100 grams, exactly. Now I'm gonna throw in some cheese. This one, I'm gonna go for 150 grams to 200. We're gonna see how much they need. So, gonna throw it a little bit on top, just like that. All right guys, so that's gonna be it, exactly 200 grams. I'm gonna throw in some more cheese on top just to get some more protein in and then some more fat, of course. And then we're gonna throw them into the oven for an extra 10 minutes. Oh, they are looking amazing. All right, guys, so here we've got the pizza. I'm gonna give you a quick taste test. And after that, I'm gonna share the macros with you. But man, this is looking absolutely amazing. Wow. Wow. I mean, for being a pizza, it is way, way better than the average normal pizza that you can buy everywhere. But it's an 8, 8.5 out of 10. But for being a low carb pizza and a diet pizza, it's a straight 10 out of 10. Man, this is incredible. All right, so in this entire meal, we've got 840 calories in total. A normal pizza has between 1,000 and 1,500, so 840 is a big meal before going to bed. We've got 16.7 grams of carbs. I did my best to keep carbs as low as possible. We've got 52.9 grams of fat. Most of the fat is coming from the cheese. And then we've got 74.3 grams of protein, which is a lot and I'm super happy for it, coming from the cheese and from the meat. So this is the last meal of the day, the third meal of the day. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. I'm gonna catch you with you guys tomorrow and show you the results if you've gained weight, lost weight and everything. So I'm gonna enjoy this one, man, because it's so, so nice. And yeah. <laughs> All right, so we're sitting at 73.8 kilos. We've lost 600 to 700. I'm gonna give you a quick little physical update. All right, guys, so as you saw, we lost a total of 700 grams, which I'm super proud because such a big number for such a short period of time. And I believe that if you've got a photo shoot, 
you can do this no carb diet or low carb diet for one or two days and you're gonna look pretty pretty lean so i was checking the footage and I was actually looking pretty lean. I could notice very easy my abs and my back. So in total yesterday I consumed 1,685 calories. I normally consume 2,500 calories right now that I'm maintaining slash cutting a little bit for the summer so I can look extra lean. Yesterday I consumed 217 grams of protein, 35 grams of carbs, and 75 grams of fat so high fat high protein very very low carbs i normally consume 215 grams i've got right here in a diet of 2500 total calories 250 grams of carbs but yesterday we just consumed 35 grams so that's gonna be it for this video if you enjoyed this one as always make sure to leave a like if you are new on the channel if you enjoy what you saw make sure to subscribe because it really helps me out it helps me reach my dream so that's gonna be it if you want to see any challenges on the channel drop a comment down below and we're gonna chat so i'll see you in my next one peace